Hello everyone, welcome back to Personal Events YouTube channel. This is Ronak Miroy. Friends, the tax filing season has almost begun. It's time that you gather all the necessary documents and review them carefully to file your income tax return or ITR. Among the many documents, Form 26AS and the Annual Information Statement or AIS are the most important documents. In this video, I'll specifically speak about Form 26AS. I will release a separate video on the Annual Information Statement or AIS next. So do click on the bell icon and subscribe to Personal Defense YouTube channel so that you do so that you are notified as soon as we release the new video. All right, friends. So let's straight away start with understanding what is Form 26 AS and how to download it. Friends, for your knowledge, the Income Tax Department usually updates Form 26 AS against your PAN on its e-filing website by mid-June, enabling you to file the ITR well before the due date. So let's understand in detail what Form 26 AS is. Form 26 AS is an annual tax statement for particular financial year containing information such as the tax deduction at source or TDS and tax collected at source or TCS against your PAN in the financial year applicable to the relevant assessment year from the various sources. Right? Note that information regarding the advance tax, self-assessment tax, details of the tax refund, statement of financial transactions, all your tax deductions at source, TDS defaults, as well as information related to pending and completed proceedings, which were earlier available in 26 AS is now available in the annual information system or AIS. So AIS is basically an extension of Form 26 AS and an important document to file your ITR. As I said, we will talk about AIS in the next video. For now, let's stick to Form 26 AS. Friends, Form 26 AS prescribed in the Rule 31 AB of the Income Tax Act 1962 and was introduced under Section 203 AA of the Income Tax Act 1961. Section 203 AA requires the Income Tax Authority or the person authorized by such authority to prepare and deliver a statement in Form 26 AS to every person, that is, every assessee. Hence, if you have paid any tax on your income or tax has been deducted from it as well as taxes collected at source, then Form 26 AS shall reflect this. As an assessee, you can review if the tax deducted and collected are correct when filing the ITR. Form 26 AS is divided into various parts. Part 1 shows the details of the tax deducted at source for dividends, interest on deposits, income from salary, etc. Part 2 shows the details of tax deducted at source for 15G or 15H as the case may be. Part 3 details of transactions under the proviso to section 194B that is winning from lottery or crossover puzzle or first provision to section 194R1 that is benefits or perquisites of business or profession where such benefits is provided in kind or where the part in cash is not sufficient to meet the tax liability and tax required to be deducted is paid before such benefit is released is mentioned here. Or proviso to section 194S1 that is payment for the transfer of virtual digital assets where the payment is in kind or in exchange of another virtual digital asset and tax required to be deducted is paid before such payment is released or section 194 BA2 that is net winnings from online games where the net winnings are made in kind or cash is not sufficient to meet the tax liability and tax has been paid before such net winnings are released. Part 4 details of tax deducted at source under 194 1A that is sale of immobile property or 194 1B that is payment of rent by certain individuals or Hindu undivided family 
or 194M that is payment to resident contractors and professionals or 194S that is TDS on transfer of virtual digital asset are cited. Part 5 carries the details of the transaction under proviso to section subsection 1 of section 194S as per form 26QE that is for the seller of virtual digital asset. Then part 6 carries the details of tax deducted at source under section 194.1a that is sale of immovable property or 194.1b that is the payment of rent by certain individuals or Hindu undivided family or 194m that is payment to resident contractors and professionals or 194s that is transfer of virtual digital assets. Part 7 carries the details of paid refund for which source is CPC TDS. For other details, you are required to refer to AIS available on the e-filing portal. Now, Part 8 carries details of the TDS under Section 194.1a.b, 194m, 194s for buyer slash tenant or property slash person making the payment to contractors or professionals slash buyer of virtual digital asset. Part 9 carries the details of transactions demand payments under proviso to subsection 1 of section 194S as per form 26QE that is for buyer of virtual digital asset. Part 10 that is TDS or TCS defaults. Note that your defaults related to the processing of refunds do not include demands raised by the assessing officer. Now coming to the question, how to view or download the form 26AS? To view and download Form 26AS, here are certain steps to follow. Step number one, log in to the income tax e-filing portal using your PAN and Aadhaar. The income tax portal link is given in the description box below. Step number two, once you enter your Aadhaar number or PAN, enter the password. In case you do not remember your password, you can reset it or you could log in using a one-time password or an OTP sent on the mobile number registered with Aadhaar. Step number three is, after you log in, under the e-filing tab, therein under income tax return, click on view form 26AS option. You shall come across a disclaimer saying you will be redirected to the TDS CPC website to view form 26AS, that is the tax credit statement. Click on confirm and proceed. Step 4. On being redirected to Trace's website, click on I agree and proceed. Step 5. After following step 4, click on the view tax credit statement. And step 6. You can review the form 26AS that is annual tax statement online or download it as PDF by selecting the relevant assessment here. For FY2324, the relevant assessment here is 2425 and choosing HTML under the view as option and then clicking on export as PDF. Step 7 is you will finally be able to view the form 26AS annual tax statement in a PDF form. Download it on a device and share it with your tax return preparer, preparer or chartered accountant for return filing purposes. Is there another way to view Form 26AS? Yes, there is. The other way to view the Form 26AS is through the net banking facility with authorized banks. But this can be done only when you have linked the PAN with the respective accounts with the bank. Here is the list of banks registered with traces providing a view of the tax credit statement. Now friends, keep in mind that if you, the assessee, find any discrepancies in the respective parts of your Form 26AS, it is important to bring it to the notice of the issuing authorities of the TDS certificates or the IT department. This shall ensure that the mistakes are not made when filing the ITR, which could cost you tax penalties and notices later. For all its analysis and verification, the IT department uses Form 26AS and AIS of the SSC. With your PAN and Aadhaar linked, the IT department is automatically notified when you transact, be it for cash deposits or high-value checks, 
when you buy property, car, bullion, jewelry, and even marriage expenses and foreign travel. Finally, friends, as law-abiding citizens, file your ITR with true and correct information for seamless and hassle-free tax filing experience. Paying your taxes on time is a constitutional and moral responsibility that shall help you contribute to the development of the nation. That's it from me today. For more guidance on mutual fund investments and personal finance, subscribe to Personal Finance YouTube channel and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and relatives. Signing off for now. Investment in securities market are subject to market risks. Read all related documents carefully before investing.